in Botswana looking for the best nightclub in Africa. And I did not expect this. Gaborone, Botswana. Pleasantly surprised. One of the quietest cities I've been to in Africa, so orderly. Unlike the likes of Nairobi and Lagos where you'd be stuck in traffic for hours. Now, I have no clue where I'm going, but I've been told there's some guys who will definitely show me where it's at and what's happening on a quest to find the best nightclub in Africa. The nightlife in Botswana has taken a hit in recent years since the government introduced a tax on alcohol and strict laws making clubs shut earlier. DJ Dollar Mac, who works for Yarona FM, the country's biggest urban radio station, thinks it's a tax on sin. Alcohol levies sin tax, uh, in short, you know, the tax you are taxed when you buy alcohol. The government has uh, decided to add that to, uh, to cap the problems we are having with alcohol. You know, where uh, we abuse it too much and um, when it's too cheap and stuff like that. It's impacted us a lot. It's made a huge impact in the clubbing industry as well as just restaurants. You've seen the huge difference that a lot of people have turned away from going to restaurants or clubs because the alcohol price is already so expensive. But the new laws were introduced to try to cut down drink driving accidents and antisocial behavior. We want to have fun, but we want to have fun responsibly. And that's what every parent wants. That's what every young people want. And it's, it's in line with our value system. The levy on alcohol has caused some clubs and pubs to close down. And while drinking in a bar or a restaurant is pretty expensive for most, people have found different ways to have a good time when the sun goes down. <laughs> Welcome to Car Park Pimping. <laughs> now here's the real parking lot, Pim. <laughs> the car park party is just that. You park up outside the bar, open up the boot, pull out the chair, and party for free with your friends. You're not paying to get inside, so the aim is just to come with your friends. If there's not enough space inside, you have your cars, there's a big parking lot. Enjoy yourselves. And this outdoor party is getting bigger and bigger. The next day, we were told about a festival on the edge of town. When we arrived, it was fairly quiet. But by nightfall, the place was jumping. And because we were in the middle of nowhere, the laws that prevent clubs and bars opening past 2 a.m. become a bit of a gray area. 